the tower. Oh no, what is this thing? Is that new? You're hot. Make your move. Oh! Oh my god, did it just what did it just release? Damn! Oh no. Oh that was really close. And welcome to our very first episode of Burning Shores The Horizon Forbidden West DLC. I am so happy to be finally starting this game with you guys. I have been waiting so long for the DLC. As soon as I finished Horizon Forbidden West, I was like, okay, all right, when is the DLC coming up? Because Horizon Zero Dawn, the Frozen Wilds DLC, was my absolute favorite part of the game. They just took everything to a whole new level, which was really incredible considering Horizon Zero Dawn was already such a phenomenal game for the time it came out in on the PlayStation 4. Like, the engine they designed for it was just spectacular. It was really, like, mind-blowing. And then they improved it even more for Frozen Wilds. And I just really loved the story, how they continued it on, the setting, it was gorgeous, and everything about it. So I'm really excited to see how they're going to kind of replicate that with Burning Shores and hopefully take Horizon Forbidden West to a new level with it, which, again, is going to be mind-blowing if they do manage to do that because Horizon Forbidden West was just a beautiful game and a beautiful use of the PlayStation 5 and in this one they only are making it for the PlayStation 5 which I'm sad for everybody who only has a PlayStation 4 right now and can't play it but also I'm really excited to see what they can do when they're not held back at all by the technology of the PlayStation 4 so I think it's just gonna be really amazing and the setting is so cool that we're in Hollywood from what we've seen in the trailer it's just gonna be amazing and there's so many like neat introductions of other machines and elements to this. And of course, I'm just really excited to be continuing our journey with Aloy. She is just such a lovable character and it's been so great to see her journey throughout these two games. So I'm really excited to have some more time with her while we wait for the third game. So yeah, I can't wait to dive into this. Let's play. I love that they changed the cover to those Burning Shore ones. Like when you first open the games, you just immediately see that Hollywood sign, the Burning Shore's logo, like the lava in the background. It's it's stunning. It's so beautiful. Oh, all right, let's play. This is so exciting. I'm so happy that we have more for Britain West content and just more time in the world of Horizon because this game is just it's everything. Everything you could want as a, like a representation of the PlayStation gaming. God, I forgot how long the loading time is. <laughs> All right, so it has been, you know, I finished Horizon Forbidden West a little while ago and I haven't picked up the game um, in a little bit, but I did go and play last night a little bit to refresh myself. So hopefully I'm not a complete and utter disaster on this. <laughs> it's so nice to see Aloy again. Oh, she's just, I love her. I love Aloy so much. <laughs> Silence, he's back. Oh god, this is actually really bittersweet seeing him right now. So this is where oh. Tilda tried to reel you in. What was her proposal? That together you could save I'm kind life. of sad now all of a sudden Doesn't seeing silence again. Mother always wanted? I believe the old ones called that a bait and switch. <laughs> luring you with the promise of a vibrant new world. When in reality it's doomed to be cracked open by nemesis and scoured of life. If you're trying to get a rise out of me about Tilda, it's not gonna work. And if you really believed we have no future, you wouldn't be here. Mm -hmm. And perhaps I'm just waiting to see if you can once again achieve the impossible. She will. Speaking of we which, know it. 
Aloy My can overcome has been anything. The new problem. I've Ooh. been searching the remains of the Zenith base for any data that could help us. In doing so, I discovered that 13 of our spacefaring friends descended to Earth from the Odyssey. But we only found 12 corpses to oh, including Verbena. There's another one. Your math is impressive as always, <laughs> but yes. It appears that one got away. His name is Walter Landra. In the 21st century, he was an aerospace magnate, but also a bit of a celebrity. I'm sure I don't have to tell you that he's far too dangerous to be allowed to roam free. You need to find him and deal with him. Interesting. All right, so we're getting our mission fairly early on. I can't quite remember how we ended up in Frozen Wilds in the last game if we knew we were walking into. I don't think we did, right? Did we get it immediately? Anyways, we just immediately kind of like have a mission here, so that's cool. Um, I would love to get some more information on what the heck an aerospace magnate is. <laughs> so Laundra made his fortune by selling spaceships? Not exactly. He built ships and drones that could mine near-Earth asteroids for rare metals, hmm. generating untold riches. I'm starting to see why you're worried. Indeed. Thanks to us, he no longer has access to the Odyssey or the Zenith base. But he likely has extensive knowledge of potent old world technologies. As such, he represents both a threat and an opportunity. You think he might know about something that can help with Nemesis? It's possible, yes. You said you've been searching through the Zenith base. Did you find anything that can help against Nemesis? I believe our best God, this game is so incredibly gorgeous. The ancient past, or both. And with such knowledge in hand, we might be able to build a weapon to hurt Nemesis in a way that it can't currently anticipate. Surprise attack? I like it. Don't get your hopes up. I found a few leads, but nothing concrete. It would be a long search, I fear. You said Walter Landra was... A bit of a celebrity. Oh yeah, I guess you don't even know what that sentence means. he made means. money in aerospace, he put vast sums into the production of holographic entertainment. In fact, his wife was a famous actress. The two of them were often featured in tabloids and other media. Tabloids. Uh, oh yeah, so much you wouldn't know about. That tracked the personal lives of celebrities. A news outlet. Allowing legions of fans. I think that's giving them a little bit too much credit. <laughs> famous. Oh. Yuck. <laughs> Alright, we know what uh, Aloy thinks about uh, fame then, I guess. <laughs> she was in today, she would not be in the tabloids. Or at least she'd be trying not to be. So where do you think Laundra went? The coast, far to the south. It kind of makes sense now why he went Aloy to Hollywood if he used to be like a famous celebrity. The few Tanakh who have ventured there refer to it as the Burning Shores. But a thousand years ago it was called Los Angeles. That is so cool. Hub for the technology and entertainment industries. Laundra's space mining company, Heaven Sent, was headquartered there. It stands to reason he would retreat to familiar territory. I'll send you the coordinates. So, are you ready to track down our rogue zenith? Hell yeah! Oh, I'm so excited. All right, let's do it to Burning Shores. Okay, to the Burning Shores then. Proceed with caution, Eloy. I suspect Londra is even more devious and resourceful than the other Zeniths. Aw, oh, silence. If I didn't know better, I'd think you were actually concerned about my safety. <laughs> this interaction, oh my gosh, it's a little bit heartbreaking now. <sighs> What's gonna happen in the next game? Anyway, I hope I haven't caught you in the middle of fighting a giant machine or something. <gasps> hey, Beta, I'm actually on the burning shores. Oh, right. And also, this is so gorgeous. Like, it's more beautiful than okay. we'll a lot of movies. We'll do. Thanks. I love seeing the um, sun wing. Wow, this is stunning. It's just been a little while since I played this game, so, you know, like, refamiliarizing myself with just how incredibly gorgeous it is. This is it. Laundra's headquarters shouldn't be far. Whoa. What? Did he do that? Uh-oh. Oh, shit! 
Flying just now? Okay, it's yeah. subtitles are back. Just, uh, <laughs> I guess it's just for that scene. Not my best landing. They're not gonna put the shit part in subtitles. Uh oh. More machines. Is this a new character? I think. Oh, this looks very familiar. Some of this. Stay back. I'll handle this. Hold on. I can help too. Let's see what you got. <laughs> oh, this is so exciting. Okay. Now let's. Get started. This is gonna be our. I have this new. Um, yeah, okay, got it. Uh, coil that like sets machines on fire, and it works. Oh crap! I did not see one right here. <laughs> Whoops. I also have been upgrading some of my stuff. So yeah, this works really effectively to set them on fire. Oh crap. Your first introduction to the machine! So exciting! Apparently there are new machines to- Oh crap, there's a lot of them here! <laughs> Jesus! Okay, we've almost got one of these. I'm gonna attempt to get this one before anything else comes after me, at least. Okay, we got one. Alright. These things are such menaces when other machines are around, it's so funny. Machines can be quite a bit more difficult in this section, so we will put that into the test. Here we go. Okay, we need more ammo. Another one! Aha! Take that. Okay, is that machine just stuck in the corner? Because he doesn't seem to be doing much. <laughs> Sorry, mid-battle. Just checking. I did hear uh, one thing people mention is that... What the heck is happening to these guys? Because, oh, this guy's, like, caught. That's why, isn't it? Let's see who takes it. <laughs> Fighting one of these guys trying to get their uh, teeth. Oh my god, it was such a pain. Some of the upgrades are so hard to get. I got ammo here. Too quick. I don't think our friend doing much to help us right now. Ah, we got it. Oh, you know that I was fun. Our first machine fight. My name's Seika. Seika. Oh I could, uh, say the same about you. That's so exciting! I'm really, I'm really happy we have a new character. Oh! So you're Quinn. You're not exactly like any diviner I've met. How do you even know that? I'm sure you have a lot of questions, but first... Just one for now. I saw you before you crashed, flying on a sunwing. It didn't look like you knew about that tower, which means you're new. So what brought you here? I'm... Looking for someone. There's a ruin. On the hill northeast of here, that's where I was headed. The ruin on the hill. You mean Starlight Rise? You know it. Is there another way to get there? Maybe. But first, we're gonna have to do something about that tower. I think we can help each other, Aloy. The tower's not far from where my people made camp. I can show you the way. Hold on. You said we can help each other, but what exactly are you doing here? Let's just say I need that tower dealt with too. Hmm. Come on. Interesting. Okay. So from what I've heard, 
there are a few glitches in this game, and some of the major glitches like, are that if you me. don't follow the character immediately, sometimes they'll get stuck and well, you won't be able to follow to them at all. So I'm not gonna stop and do any what like collecting of stuff, anyway. <laughs> just in case. Skip's rudder is a bit off. I was after some parts to fix it. And sometimes, <gasps> look at the ship. Hunt alone. Here she is. I just need to attach this component I picked up. Full tight. Never seen a boat like that before. Mm -hmm. Me and a gear head back at the settlement roped it together. Works well enough. Gosh, look at how realistic the That'll water looks. It. Like, it's really it's incredible. Hop in. Oh no. Not another one. Whoa. Like I said. There's no getting to Starlight Rise so long as that tower's there. Hmm. Okay. Casting off. I'm so happy to see Aloy huh. again and sure Okay, going. what's her name? Skyler? Time to improve Psyka, design. Psyka. <laughs> How long have your people been here? Uh, about a year, I think. We hit this massive storm crossing the great ocean. Lost half the fleet and our hmm. bearings. It was a miracle we even made it to these shores. We've been stuck here ever since. See. Wow. I'm uh I'm sorry to hear that. Just how many of you are left? Not as many as there should be. We've had other troubles since the shipwreck. And some of those remaining aren't much help. Sounds like you're not thrilled to go back. Bring back an outlander certainly going to complicate things. It'll be fine. Just follow my lead and let me do the talking. If you say so. I love the music already. That's it on your left. Wow, look at the storm. So this kind of reminds me of Frozen Wilds. We weren't in great spirits when we made landfall. Yeah, because like in Frozen Wilds, you get this view of the like volcano the entire time. This is a little bit reminiscent of that, having like the storm in the background okay. and then the uh, here we go. The magma on the shores. Even though it's more of a tropical than a, a, a frozen ecosystem. I don't know anything further. May I be dismissed? No. You will remain here until the traitor returns. The traitor? You! Yeah, <laughs> I guess she means her. Here we go. Sorry. One act of treason breeds another, it seems. Stealing a diviner's focus, leading a barbarian into our midst. Where's the Quinn I know? <laughs> Arrest them both. Remove their focuses at once. Arrest us. This is a matter for the Admiral, not a compliance officer. <sighs> Their costumes are incredible. And just like every detail, like in the tassels. This is probably all stuff I said while playing Horizon for Ben West originally, but I just like rediscovering how beautiful this game is. It's true. Sinka stole the focus. Who's the barbarian? She's done for. Things seem kind of tense around here. It's not our best day. Admiral Garrett, it's as I told you, sir. The proof is now before your eyes. A soldier dared to don a diviner's focus, the eye that reveals the legacy. But Seika did not stop there. She brought a barbarian among us in direct violation of confidentiality clause 3A. Protocol he is state. way too happy about this. This might be our last chance at finding our missing people, sir. Diviner Vi's focus showed me his last moments. He found a clue. The ruin on Starlight Rise. There's evidence our people were there. Andra's headquarters. Mm. Now we have no means of safe passage. Not in our current situation. But she might have another way. Remember the law, sir. Focus is for a diviner. No one else. 
Saker's actions are indeed concerning. And there will have to be a reckoning. But finding our lost crew is paramount. If Seika has a chance of bringing them back, our course is clear. Even compliance must recognize that. I will allow it. Seika and the Outsider are free to pursue this lead. But sir, if... That's right, walk away. <laughs> Lender, I'd like a word when you have a moment. Hmm. Damn them. You okay? I shouldn't have said that. It's just that... My sister is one of the missing. Mm. Not only that, she's our last navigator. Our only means of getting home. I've got to find her. Even if it means using a forbidden relic. Meanwhile, Rang and the others act like I'm the problem, when in reality, I'm the only one looking for a solution. Look, I, I understand. Maybe more than you know, but... For now, I think we need to calm down I and just- calm! <laughs> I'm not so sure about that. <laughs> You're right, of course. Getting upset Although, isn't going telling to somebody to calm down when they're upset is never the right choice of words, so I should probably okay. learn that. <laughs> we both need to get to the place you call Starlight Rise. But that tower seems like it knocks anything nearby out of the sky. Out of the water, too. Mm -hmm. It fires at any watercraft in range. Oh, great. Well. It seems to me you've got some kind of plan in mind to deal with it. Maybe. Between the two of us, there might be a way. Well, you're a good fighter, that's for sure. But beyond that, I don't know much about you. There's not much to tell. Nothing special about me. Except my sister is pretty well known among my people. You don't seem so ordinary to me. I was just a petty officer until we ran aground. But we lost a lot of midshipmen and lieutenants to the storm and the wreck. Mm. And now even more of them are missing. So I've been trying to step up and help the Admiral. It took a lot of guts putting on that focus. Seems to me he needs more like you. Huh. Tell that to Rang in his toadies. His toadies? <laughs> never heard that saying before but i kind of like it it's a very like a wholesome way of insulting somebody so your sister is a navigator more like the navigator mm. the only quen who can steer by the stars without instruments she reads the sky like a scroll mm. knows every constellation by position no matter how much it spins around up there which means she's been an imperial favorite ever since her first exam one of the fleet's most precious assets. And now she's gone. And she and the others just disappeared? After we made landfall, the hard way, the Admiral sent out scouting expeditions with the very few boats we had left. Not one of them returned. Mm -hmm. I don't know what happened to them all, but I do know it has something to do with that tower. And Starlight Rise. We're agreed on that. Is there anything else you can tell me about that tower? It just appeared one day a couple of weeks ago after our scout boats went missing. And it shoots at anything in the sky or sea. Machines, boats... You. Okay, don't remind me. <laughs> I tried to get near it, but it's mounted on a tall ruin with machines all around. On the plus side, its range is limited. I've been testing it with my skiff and setting up buoys to mark the radius. <laughs> Can't tell if that's smart or reckless. Both. It's like something yeah. Aloy might do, I so. <laughs> been a couple of near misses. What 
exactly did you find on that Diviner's Focus? When the scout boat sent by the Admiral didn't return, he sent our very last one to find out what happened to them. Diviner Vi was on board. They made it as far as Starlight Rise, went inland and found a camp and a bunch of equipment. It looked like some of our people went into a ruin there. Then they spotted a machine, unlike anything we've seen. Mm. Silver and gold moved like a spider. A spider? Oh Spooked. no. They We're gonna have to, to fight some spider machine? To escape. Ugh. I've dealt with those things. I'm before. both excited the ran out fast. and mm, the morning scared. they tried to sail back, <laughs> the tower went up and blew them right out of the water. Vi's body washed ashore here sometime later. A friend of mine found it and let me know. The same friend that ratted me out to Rang for taking the focus. But what was I supposed to do? I would have done the same thing. Trust me. Okay, let's just take a minute to appreciate the music in the background again. So incredible. You think there's a way to do something about that tower? If we want to reach Starlight Rise, we have to try. I was able to approach the tower on foot, but I couldn't get close enough to shoot at it or anything like that. With the right help, though... Show me the way and we'll give it a shot. You'll probably want to resupply first. You can use my skiff if you need to hunt for resources. Just stay south of the settlement. The tower can't hit that side. I set up some buoys to mark its radius. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go clear my head. There's a bridge that leads to the ruins where the tower is mounted. I'll wait for you on the other side. Hold on. There's one more thing. The, the Quen here, all of this. You were part of a larger expedition, right? Headed for San Francisco? That's how you know about us. And you've seen the others, haven't you? And they're alive. Most of them, yeah. I can put you in touch with them, but we should find your missing people first, right? They're alive. This is great news. But yes, you're right, it, it should wait. If we tell everyone now, it'll just be a distraction. So for the sake of the missing, we have to keep the focus on them. All right then, I'll see you on the other side of the bridge. All right. You might Skyla. not be a bad idea to resupply before I meet Seika. Or I could explore a little with her skiff first. Okay, that sounds really cool, but I will leave that for later. <laughs> um, we will have plenty of time to, to explore later, so... I am super excited to see this new area, though. Okay, so yeah, this is Burning Shores. It looks quite big! Interesting that it's completely isolated from the rest of the map because Forbidden or Frozen Wilds was still kind of part of the map, but this was just like a completely different area. Oh, yeah, there's the rest of it. Okay. All right, let's go find. I like her. I like her new character, Saika. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get confused by her. Oh, did we already have a side quest? Did I see a green arrow? Oh, there is. Oh, that's so cool. I'm so excited to keep playing this. It's so nice to be back. And to have so much to do again. I definitely don't have the platinum for Frozen, uh, for, oh my God, I'm gonna get those confused so often. <laughs> I definitely don't have the, what's that? Okay, anyways, sorry, this is like too many distractions. <laughs> I can't even get through one sentence. I don't have the platinum yet for Forbidden West. So um, I still have some stuff to do there too, but you know, now I have a whole other section to work on and, uh, and then I can go back to, to Forbidden West and, and complete some of the last things to do. Okay, maybe it's time to meet up with Seika and head to the tower. Seika, I'm gonna remember that. Oh crap. I'm to stain my hands. What's hey, the look. sounds? Over here. You can hear birds already. Also, I have 348 rocks. And I don't use rocks for anything, but I have collected many of them, and I will keep collecting many rocks. <laughs> hey, I'm here. So, uh, how do we get to the tower? These trails will lead us to it. Take your pick. All right. Okay. Let's go. Hmm. 
The sounds of the birds are just lovely. Like, it is pouring rain outside here. I know a lot about my people, but I barely know anything about you. Like, who you're looking for at Starlight Rise? Uh, he's a, uh... Ah, crap. Fugitive. Come on. That's all you've got? Let's just focus on getting to the tower. Oh. It's so mysterious. We got some machines! I love how they make the little jumpy. Time to pick them off. Come back. Oh, oh, he went straight for me. Shoot it. Come on, come on. Oh, it sounds like somebody else sees me. Oh no, I missed my chance. Hey, we got him. some pretty crazy machines i'm so excited to see them like is this what they're gonna be able to do with the enemies now that they it's only on the playstation 4 i have a feeling it's gonna be a lot more difficult the other day i saw the tower shoot down an entire flock wow it's crashed into the sea south of fleet's end i've never seen one before that tower's gotta go oh my gosh what is that what is that noise? <laughs> so many rocks. To the tower. Last time I was there, I didn't get very far in. Oh no! What is that? There's some kind of machine. Gross. I haven't seen that before. Kind of looks like. Oh God! Mask. What the heck? Oh, the mate. Attached a machine. Oh my God! Whoa! What are these things? Down it goes. Do we get them all? Broadcaster time. Oh! Where is that coming from? Oh crap! Burn it. Oh wow, that's handy. Okay, there's more apparently. Where's that coming from? Where is the other machine? Apparently there's something watching us, but I have no idea where it is. All right. Oh. Here's to the hunt. This is fun, actually. I like fighting these things. They're so, they're kind of cute. They're actually really cute. I feel a little bit bad about killing them. Okay. Those definitely weren't here last time. More eggs. That's kind of gross. <laughs> Oh, there's there's a lot of them. Oh my gosh. I think they're fairly easy to kill. Level 38! Oh, I have a bunch of upgrade points that I need to use. <laughs> yeah, I have like 30. Oh my gosh. Alright, after this episode, I will uh, definitely go spend my uh, skill points for sure. I have way too many just to sit on them. Oh no. There's a lot of the eggs here. Yuck. Those 
Those eggs are everywhere. What are they releasing? This like powder is kind of gross. Let's move in carefully. There is so much stuff to collect. Oh no. Here we go. Why do they keep dropping? Oh no. No, too far away. All right. Like there's so many cool animals they can make into this, so like they just endlessly have new. Alert. We'll have to oh deal man! To get into the tower. See what you got there. You're on. Make the move. Oh, where are they? Whoa! I better not go up to that. Actually, it's <laughs> probably not a good idea. All right, we gotta make sure we're fully stocked up on stuff right now because we know this boss fight is about to get intense, so. It's laying more eggs. Oh, it's the, oh my God. It's the more the merrier, I guess. 
<laughs> it's the frog. These are the eggs from the frog. What the heck? That is so adorable, but also like a huge nuisance. For sure. I'm gonna try and take out a few more of these before we. You fried them! Chain reaction. Useful. Alright. See how many of these we can take out before we have to fight the frog. The froggy! He's so cute! <laughs> Super fun. I got your back. Too far away now. Okay. Do we go after the frog now? Alright, scan. I'd like to scan him and see his weaknesses before we really get in there. Okay. Should hit it with frost ammo. Weak to fire and frost. Alright, let's do it. Oh. Crap! No! <laughs> oh. Nice. Alright, what? This is so cool, the sound in the background. Oh man. Another one. Where'd you go? Oh. Alright. Now we've gotta be ready. I think we're ready. Alright, oh no, he released a whole bunch of them. Oh crap! No! 
Oh, that's annoying. I should, I, can, I shouldn't have paid a lot more attention to that. Oh my god, can I climb this? Shit. <laughs> How do I get back? Oh no! Can I not get up this? Okay, here we go. We can climb back now. Well, I might as well take this opportunity to restock. <laughs> Whoops. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, I probably glitched it out now. That's hilarious. Whoops. All right, let's go back to this fight. Did not realize, whoops, how far I was away. All right, let's light him up. I would expect. What is she doing? Whoa, we Jesus. got a jumper. You gotta stay away from this guy. What did it just do? Just like non stop. Can't 
Take the heat! Ghost. Yeah. Good fight. Come on. The entrance I found is this way. Okay. This is where you gotta follow her immediately, apparently. I think. I don't know. Just somewhere. I'm kind of scared not to follow, so. <laughs> I'll have to warn our patrols later. Doubt that machine was the only one of its kind. Feels like every day there's something new that's trying to kill us. That was so exciting. I really like that boss fight. It was really intense. I was like literally in my chair going like, ah! Where'd she go? Let's get up there. Oh, here we go. Here. Just gotta get across. Think you can make it? Watch me. Where'd she go? Oh, here we go. You can jump again immediately after landing by tapping next. Oh, that's cool. This is as far as I got. I couldn't find a way to get further up. All I'll right, that's where Aloy comes in. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. Ah. Uh, oh, nice. Okay, I was just gonna say I forget how to do the pole caster. So that's helpful. Injure somebody. You made that look easy. About your fugitive, I need to know who we're dealing with. It can't be a coincidence that he and my people are both at Starlight Rise. His name's Walter Londra. He's a Zenith. It's what the Quen would call a living ancestor. A living ancestor? But that would mean he's been alive for centuries. Mm -hmm. Take me. You're serious. I'm so glad they're giving us the instructions again because there's a lot of stuff that I've forgotten. This is very. Oh, fuck. You gotta be kidding me. Anyways. <laughs> uh, yeah. There's a lot of stuff I've forgotten, so I'm happy they're, they're helping us out a little bit there. things okay well we're going back up again <laughs> this is not very far and like easy to find where we need to go feels very reminiscent of Horizon Forbidden West, you know, all the cl uh, tower climbing. Uh... Oh, well, uh, there you go, Seika. <laughs> Thanks. Hold square to activate shield, might have to jump me backwards. I think Ugh. you can get that vent open. You can grapple strike certain objects by tapping X in the air while in range. Wow, that was such a cool, like, animation. She flies, she fights machines, <laughs> and she has fancy moves. Somebody has sounds like they have a bit of a crush on Aloy. I mean, why not? She's really cool. <laughs> mm. 
Wish you'd come along earlier. Might have gotten more done by now. I bet you must be pretty important to your tribe. Well, I'm an outcast, actually. Yeah. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm better off without them. And from what I saw back at the settlement, maybe you would be too. I am one of the chosen people, not some weak kneed sailor who abandoned ship when the seas get rough. Okay, never mind. Aw, that's a little tough. Okay, I guess we're just jumping across. Oh, that was close. Aloy, shall we continue? <laughs> yes, this impatient, apparently. <laughs> Oh, wait, where'd she go? Oh. <laughs> hmm. Hold square while falling to deploy the shield ring and glide. Okay, maybe we're supposed to use. Ah, fuck, hold it, not. God damn it. Where am I now? I keep, uh, for some reason, tapping square, not <laughs> holding it. So that's that's on me for sure. Okay. I was never very good in Horizon Forbidden West at making it up these towers. So <laughs> bear with me. Probably gonna be even messier now. I would scale the ruin like this since huh? the Navy's endurance drills. <laughs> you used to climb ruins as training. Oh yeah. Every time we thought we were done, my commander would say, One more floor! <laughs> Good thing you weren't afraid of heights. There we go! No! Why didn't she grab it? Why didn't she grab it? Oh man. Yeah, this is, this is gonna be, this is gonna be tough. It seems to always fall with me, at least. Oh, wait. Okay. Okay. Oh, made it. Finally. Nats, nice rub this whole corner. I'll find another way over. I think we're almost at the top. Then we can find a way to shut the tower down. found another target. Uh oh. Tower down to another machine. I can't wait to shut it down. Some kind of crystal. Mm. Oh. Strong smell. <laughs> Merchants might be interested though. You have a piece of brimshine, a rare and valuable resource. Hidden in the burning shores, the brimshine can be used for um, upgrading certain weapons and outfits or trading with specific merchants. Cool. We got a save point, which means we don't have to keep <laughs> falling off that tower again, so that's nice. Wow. That looks crazy, and that is definitely one of the... Uh, it looks like something Laundra would have built. Yeah. Well, Definitely build that. It looks like they're kind of, you know, stuff. But how do we stop it when part of it's way up there? Let's take a look around. Hmm. Wow, it's really cool the feedback you can get in the controller while you're close to this. Find something? Maybe. How do we get up? I guess we need to follow this, but how do we get to the next floor?
We're getting a lot of um, upgrade potential from this. Like a lot of the stuff we're picking up in crates is like purple or orange, which is nice. Oh. Ah, crap. How do we do this again? Damage until... Okay, how do we... Ooh! Okay, what's back here? Oh, crap. God, look at the view! Wow. I can't wait to get to the top and like take that in. traps everywhere when I don't mean to. <laughs> I don't really even use traps as the thing. I mean, let's say out of the limits on how many you can place. I just don't use them quite as often. I never really used them a whole lot in the first place, but yeah, definitely not now. Hmm. See, how can I get to the next level? Maybe if I go over there? We're gonna try it. This might be some kind of access node. Oh, okay. Wow. That's really cool looking. It's coming down. Aloy, I truly hope you've enjoyed this tower. I set it up just for you. Oh no. Right. Recording from Londra. Let it be a reminder that unlike my former colleagues, oh, shit. I'm one step ahead of you. Uh, that doesn't look good. Getting ready to fire it up. Get the cover. Oh no. Jeez. Get the cover. How are we supposed to stop this thing? Yeah. Let me see. Oh crap. All drugs fire. What are you doing, Aloy? Like? It's got a power core on the back. Over here, you! I gotta get up there to destroy it. Oh crap. Sorry. No, no, this doesn't look right. Drop down. Drop down. Okay, how did I get up again? Now I have to rediscover this. Beforehand, <laughs> just casually leaves her uh, friends. 
<laughs> All alone. Okay, time to hit that power core. I think it knows you're up there, Aloy. Take cover. Damn it. Come on! Fire at me! Not her! Oh, jeez. fights already. I'm very excited about that. That was not that hard though at all. <laughs> it didn't really pay attention to us like it's whatsoever. Just... Well that didn't go exactly how I thought it would. It turned out okay. Yeah. And now you're that was totally fine. To Starlight Rise, right? Yeah. I saw it fly off when I crashed. I should be able to call it back. One step closer to finding my sister and the living ancestor you're after. But I should probably report to the Admiral first, give him some assurance that we've made progress. Okay, I'll meet you back at the settlement then. You know, I'm kind of glad you tagged along. I like them together. Whatever they are, friends or more. They're cute. It's nice to see Aloy like with another friend. Is not like other corners. Oh, that's for sure. And with the tower down, I could check out the area before meeting up with her. Maybe stock up on some resources while I'm at it. Call over and fly mount. Okay. Oh, all right. How do I get to him then? Came close enough for a second. Here we go. We go. Back to the spies. I love this part. Okay. Salary. Cover it up. Land. Barrel roll. Break. And sound and then hold to release stuff. Okay. Got it. Okay, this is cool. I want to like fly over a little bit and like see everything.
find it very difficult to get used to flying, but oh my gosh, this is so cool looking. Boy, the shield ring they're holding. Oh, cool. No, oh crap. <laughs> That was, that was close. Please end. Are they gonna enjoy having a Sunwing fly in here? I love the Sunwings, they're so cool looking. Like, I want a replica of a sun ring, sun wing. Like a little figure to have, that would be pretty cool. I'm here, you're here. Are we doing this? <laughs> okay, all right, all right. <laughs> okay, so, shall we get going to Starlight Rise? Uh, oh, am I gonna do this right now? Hmm, okay, I think we're gonna save this for next episode, actually. <laughs> I might do a little bit of exploring in the meantime. Something else first. But I am very excited to get back to this. All right, yeah, so we'll save that for next time. Oh, I'm super, that was great. I'm so happy to be playing it again. Like, I missed Horizon Forbidden West. And I know you can always just like play more of it. You know, I could replay Horizon Forbidden West, which I would really like to do. But also it's just so cool to have more of the story and just more characters coming in and more of the world to explore. Like this whole section looks really gorgeous and I'm so excited to see more of it and kind of recognize more of the Hollywood locations. We haven't really seen anything too like distinct yet. Like there was one building that kind of looked a little bit familiar. I haven't spent a ton time in in California and LA or in specific I've only been there like once or twice maybe but anyways there's one building that like kind of looked familiar but other than that we I'm excited to like get more into the city and just see stuff that's like oh my god that's Hollywood like I hope they have some of the really cool locations like obviously they're gonna have a sign but you know like the walk with all the stars and like I don't know there's just lots of cool stuff they could put in this so super excited to do some more exploring love encountering new machines that frog was great he was so cute and so funny but also just like a meta for for sure and like oh my god he was spitting acid everywhere like jump landing on you non-stop which is really dangerous and uh just shooting stuff at you and then his cute little flies his little his little things that were flying around they're so what like why are the machines so cute they're so adorable i don't want to kill them but also they are deadly for sure so <laughs> i'm super excited to see what other brand new machines we have in this like i was saying because they're modeled after animals, there's so many options for cool animals they can make into machines. So it's just like awesome to see their creativity coming out and just like always get excited to see new things. And yeah, so uh, that was super fun. Um, more of the Zenith stuff, like bringing back in the far Zenith is kind of cool. I mean, that was such a big focus in the last game. And so it's neat that they have like another character coming into this on, on the DLC, but who's like a part of it. I'm interested to meet this guy a little more. I feel like he's gonna be a very interesting character. Um, and then yeah, our new our new character, uh, Psycho. <laughs> I'm gonna forget that literally every time. I'm so bad with names. Anyways, I love having a new character. So far she seems really great. I like her personality. I like her and Aloy together. They have a nice interaction going on. So I can't wait to keep playing. I'm so happy we finally have a DLC. And I'm so happy I get to play with you guys and just obsess over Horizon Forbidden West again because I just love the Horizon series so much. And I love Aloy and I, I love this world. So I can't wait to keep exploring it more. And yeah. If you guys are brand new to the channel, definitely uh, think about subscribing. I'm gonna be continuing to play this game. In the future, I'll be playing more of like whatever the next game comes out. I also have my playthrough for Horizon Forbidden West on the channel, a teeny bit of Horizon Zero Dawn and Frozen Wilds because I'd already played it before I started the channel. So there's not much, but there's a couple episodes of that. And then I also have some fan art on here from Horizon Zero Dawn, and I would love to make some Horizon Forbidden West ones in the future. So stay tuned for all of that. I would love to hear guys' thoughts on the game so far. So leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Have you encountered any of the major glitches that I've heard about? Because I mean, so far it seems to be running fine for me, but I have heard from other people that there are a few glitches. Like for example, when you're following a character, uh, if you don't follow them immediately after a boss fight, you can get stuck and they won't move. So I'm a little bit nervous about that, which is why I'm not stopping to collect things um, after a boss fight. Um, but yeah, let me know. Have you encountered any glitches? What do you think of the game? Leave a comment. I love reading your guys' thoughts on these games. Other than that, I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day or night whenever you're watching this. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you for another episode.